In QuickBooks Online, how do we determine how much customers owe us? Well, that's pretty easy and there's several ways to do it. Probably the fastest way to do it is you go over to Sales and then go down to Customers. Or if you click on Sales, you would go over to Customers up here. And then this number right here tells us that our customers owe us a total of $5,282. And there's 20 open invoices. Remember, an invoice occurs when a customer buys something from us and then promises to pay later. Now, this is a nice, quick way to find the information. But what if you need more detail? And what if you need to print it out? Well, if you want to print it out, you have to go to Reports. So let's go over to Reports. We're going to click on Reports. And if you know the name of the report, you can just type it up here, such as Open Invoices. But let's not do that. Let's scroll down and look at some of the other reports that show us how much our customers owe us. So in this section called Who Owes You, we see that we have lots of different reports. One called Open Invoices and one called Customer Balance Detail. So let's click on Open Invoices and see what that shows us. So the Open Invoices report lists all unpaid invoices for each customer as of a specific date. This date is right here, November 17th, but if you wanted to change it, you would change it up here and then click Run Report. The report lists each open invoice with date and invoice number for each customer. It also lists the terms and the due date. And if we scroll down, we should see that same total amount due to us, $5,281.52. So another report that gives a little bit more details is also found on the report section. So let's go to reports, scroll down to who owes you, and then let's click on customer balance detail. So if I scroll down to the very bottom, it's still showing us that total $5,281.52 of accounts receivable. In other words, the amount, total amount that customers owe us. But this report gives us a little bit more detail. It shows us the original amount and how much is open, and then the balance, as well as the original date and the invoice number. So the extra information that the customer balance detail provides us that the open invoices did not is that uh, the open invoices did not include this original amount of the invoice. It only showed the open balance. So depending on how much detail you need, choose between those two reports.